Loser, I've been looking for you. Hey, what's that? Wait, let me see. <sighs> hey, what the hell is wrong with you today? What do you mean, it's nothing? You literally just flinched. I didn't even touch you. Huh? Ah, uh, whatever. Be that way, then. Go ahead and deflect all you want. Look, I came to look for you because I need your help tomorrow. Yeah, it's for the maths exam. You know I can't trigonometry for shit. Help me out. Okay, I need to at least survive high school before I do whatever the hell I want. What? You look so shocked. Can't bullies have a sense of responsibility? <laughs> I'll have you know, I give more shits about school than I let on. It's just unfortunate that I'm quite stupid. Anyway, meet me at the library tomorrow. <laughs> okay. Okay. Something is definitely wrong. You would not say yes to anything I ask for before at least saying a thousand no's. For real, you are not acting like your usual self. Something happened for sure. And you, you are going to tell me. Why? Cause we're like, best friends. Yeah. A best friend who pushes you around sometimes. So, tell me what's up. What's with the way you're acting? And how did you get that gigantic purple bruise on your arm? Huh? You got that bruise when I pushed you? You're fucking kidding me. Dude. You're kidding me, right? I never push you that hard. It's just play fighting. <laughs> Dude, why are you so quiet? Tell me you're kidding. Yeah? <laughs> okay. Good. Sheesh. So, if it wasn't because of me, what happened? Look, we can bring this full circle if you want, but I'm not leaving until I know. What? Your boyfriend did that? <laughs> what? That hideous guy? What happened? No, no, no. You're not leaving. Tell me what happened. Yeah, I am hella worried. No one gets to push you around, but me. He... What? At the beach party? You saw him with some other girl? Got mad and yelled at him. <laughs> Dude, that's not your fault. He should be burying his head in the sand, getting caught cheating. What a fucking asshole. So, what happened next? 
He wanted you to shut up, so he hit you. And with so many people at the beach party, not a single person showed up to stop him. The music was too loud, and you guys were in a secluded area. <sighs> Dude, let me tell you, if I had been there, he would be missing an eye by now. Violence is not the answer. Oh my god. You've got to be kidding. <sighs> what? You're still dating that guy after what he did to you? Are you crazy? You can't make excuses for someone who intentionally hurts you. Ever. Hey, don't you normally go home around this time? With him? I remember you said he doesn't want you around other boys. <laughs> what a hypocrite. Listen. I'm walking you home today. The last thing I want is for you to get hurt again. And look, I'm sorry I push you around sometimes. I only ever mean it as a joke. I never intend to hurt you. I hope you can see that just from the way I play around. With you. Hey. Hey. It's okay to cry. I'm sorry. I'm genuinely sorry. I'll never do that again. I'm just... Kind of... Emotionally constipated. Uh, the thing is, I kinda... Um... Kinda have a thing for you. And... Ever since you started dating that guy... I just... I've been jealous, I guess. And I knew he was bad for you. Bad for everyone, really. So, the fact that you went with him, it just added insult to injury. <laughs> what do you mean I was never honest with my feelings? Don't you know... Pushing girls around is how jocks express affection. <laughs> Look, I'm not asking you to reciprocate my feelings or anything. Not right now, at least. That's the last thing you need. Right now, what you need is plenty of rest and a safe environment. And for the next few days, I'll keep you safe, alright? I'm sure he'll come looking for you, and I'll give him a good punch in the face when he does. Hey, hey. Don't worry. I'm here for you. I've always been. You're just blind and never saw. <laughs> now, come on. Here, hold my hand. Let's get going.